everybody. Uh, so it's Renee from Rat Sash, and Hi. here's Todd. He's driving though. Don't distract him. Morning, folks. How y'all doing? <laughs> What's up? <laughs> <laughs> He's distracting. <laughs> um, uh, so I'm back from uh, my trip. I'm back in Pennsylvania, and I'm freezing. I'm freezing. So my face is nice and tan, if you can see. Uh, I am starting to peel. So I did have, I did get a little bit of a burn, but all, all's good. Um, I had a wonderful time. I hope you like the videos uh, that I put up for the places that I was able to go and see. Now, sadly, I wasn't able to thrift um, or flea market or pick or anything like that on our trip. What vacations are for to do that? <laughs> Well, it was a girl's trip, and, um, you know, um, some of my girlfriends just don't, uh, they're, they're not into that kind of stuff. So, I do have, uh, you know, I have a couple friends that they, they aren't into it, which is fine, you know, but, um, we did have a really nice girlfriend's weekend, and that's really important to have, too. So, uh, they are, uh, my really good close girlfriends, so it was really nice to see everybody, um, so uh, I wanted to tell you, uh, yesterday was Halloween. I did not do a video because um, it was family time. Halloween's really big uh, for me. I love Halloween. It's one of my favorite holidays. I love dressing up. I love being silly. I love it. I love it. I love it. And I married a man who loves it too. So <laughs> I will post some pictures over here, right here, right right there. I'll post some pictures of what we were yesterday. Um, exciting thing was we did take our granddaughter trick-or-treating for the first time. Yes. So she was, um, she's, she's, uh, been in costumes, but she's only two years old. She has been in costumes already. This is, this is a technically her third Halloween. Uh, so she was in costumes, but mommy just kind of kept her at the house and was handing candy out to people. So yesterday was her first time going to people's houses and asking for candy. And she was so excited for that. Um, so she was very polite and she said trick or treat. So mommy taught her very well. Yes. And, th and thank you. She yes. said, thank you. Yeah, please. And thank you. Yeah, well. Please. Yeah. And thank yeah. you. And she was the cutest little mini mouse I've ever seen ever. Cute. Cute. <laughs> so it was really nice. Um, what was nice is that me, uh, me and Todd both dressed up. We drove over an hour to go see her and we surprised them because they were, you know, like, oh, I couldn't believe when we came. I said, well, I wasn't going to miss this for the world. So we drove there. And then what was nice is Todd's, uh, Todd's ex-wife, uh, Mimi, they call her Mimi, I'm Nene. Um, she dressed up too, so it was so funny. So it was the two grandmas dressed up and Pop Pop dressed up, and we were handing out candy. And uh, me and me and uh, me and the, me and the other grandma were handing candy out. And Todd and uh, Todd and his daughter and his son-in-law and Lacey they went out trick or treating. So it was really a lot of fun, and yeah. we saw some really great costumes. <laughs> and you know what? <laughs> I got a rock. You got a rock. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see if anybody understands what, or knows the <laughs> meaning of that. Oh my God, a rock. Um, so uh, anyway, uh, now you've seen my costume. I made that costume literally that morning. So we've had those these heads. Uh, we've had Batman and Chewbacca heads. We had them for a couple years. We got them. They were at Walmart and they had come out. They were so cool. And I thought, well, I definitely want them. And they actually sit on a shelf in our nerd cave that we have. So we do have Flash, Wonder Woman. We have, that's who we were last year for Christmas. Yes, we were. Or Christmas. Oh my God. Last year for Halloween, we which is, I'll show you that picture right now. There, that, that's a picture right now. So we were, we were Flash and Wonder Woman last year and this year um I was gonna we were gonna do Flash and Wonder Woman again and then all of a sudden I'm like you know what would be really kind of fun if we were the Batman and Chewbacca and that was at eight o'clock in the morning <laughs> because that's how I roll so uh we scrounged up costume and duct tape and I made my costume 
in a matter of 20 minutes. Yep. And I think I looked really cool. You look good. Yeah. So, uh, anyway. Uh, comment below. Let us know what you guys did for Halloween. We thought that was, uh, we always think it's fun to dress up and stuff. We walked around our thrift store, um, all in costumes and stuff, and we basically were in our Halloween costumes, uh, from 10 o'clock, 10 o'clock in the morning till 8 o'clock last night. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> we're just a bunch of big kids. Yeah. So, anyway, uh, we are on our way right now to an auction. Uh, yeah. Yeah. So we're back to picking. So we're on it. We're on our way to an auction, and we'll do a video there at the auction. As you can see, the back is empty. Those are two empty bins, and we're empty. So we're ready to fill it up. We saw some uh, preview pictures, and there were some really cool things that we really liked that were there. So we're making the long drive out to Bushholds Auction. Yep. Um, so. If you haven't liked Bushholds Auction um, or the auction at Renninger's, uh, they go by two different names, um, please do so. They're uh, really good friends of ours, and uh, we love doing uh, videos out there. So yes, we have, we have, yes, please help us. We have an addiction. <laughs> we have an auction addiction. What? We're, help what? us, please. Huh? Yeah, help, help us, please. No. Well, <laughs> we're so addicted to auctions that there's something that maybe you don't know about me. Want to tell him? No, you don't. Oh. So I am an apprentice auctioneer. Uh, it's it's exciting. Uh, I got my license two years ago, almost two years ago. Um, so it's up for renewal, but I am an apprentice auctioneer. And I did take a, a, I did do a bunch of auctions myself with another company. Unfortunately, that company's not around anymore, but I am an apprentice auctioneer and I am, uh, just tried it out to see if I would like it, and I love it. So, my next move is probably uh, going to collaborate with someone else and uh, see about getting my full-time auctioneer license. Uh, so, you know, always, always trying to do something different, right? Yeah, we got to try to sell me off next. <laughs> He's gonna go to the highest bidder. What do you think? <laughs> No. And give you a very high bidder then. No, he's priceless. <laughs> Hardly. You're priceless. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, you guys have a great day. Uh, watch our video number two uh, of us at the auction. Hopefully, we'll get a nice, good video there. And we'll also walk around. So, yep. very exciting. Uh, last thing for today. Today is the Day of the Dead. Um, it is a really... It's a really cool day for me. I always wanted to, it's on my bucket list to actually go to Mexico for the Day of the Dead. How do you say it? You say it really fun. I don't. Say it again. No. I can't, I don't speak Spanish and I don't say it very well, but um, I, I'm just going to say it in English. It's the Day of the Dead. So uh, it's really uh, a cool day where um, people celebrate those that had passed on. So, uh, yeah, it's, it's, I, I, and I, well, I've loved it before, but even that movie Coco that came out, what a cool movie that was. So, so today, just take an extra special little moment of time and think of those that have passed on, uh, because today is the day of the dead. All right. Have a wonderful day and we'll talk to you later. Bye. See you later.